March 1993, she went on to teach at Dartmouth College. She also founded her own company, the Jameson Group, which seeks to encourage a love of science in students and bring advanced technology to schools all around the world. She is a strong advocate for science and established an international science camp for high school students. Mae Jameson is the epitome of beauty and brains. Take note, we thank you and we love you for your commitment to the education of the STEM field. CW is a TV, film, and Broadway legend whose career has spanned seven decades. It's the incomparable Cicely Tyson. Woo! Tyson has been a part of some of the most impactful films in history, including Sounder, Roots, and The Help. But what's most special about Miss Tyson is that she never compromised who she was and what she stood for for a role. Wow. She has built a successful career by carefully choosing roles that exemplified quality and depth. She once said in an interview, unless a piece really said something, I had no interest in it. Mm. I have got to know that I have served some purpose here. Tyson has been recognized for her work with accolades that include three Primetime Emmy Awards, four Black Reel Awards, one Screen Actor Guild Award, one Tony Award, Ooh. and the first African-American woman to receive an honorary Academy Award. Tyson has also been a Kennedy Center honoree and recipient of the Presidential Medal of Freedom. At 95 years young, Cicely Tyson is still actively making appearances in today's hottest new shows and movies. Ms. Tyson, we thank you for dedicating your life to enriching ours with your undeniable talent. Yes! Okay. My turn! My WCW was born Marguerite Johnson. She is a world-renowned American poet, storyteller, activist, and autobiographer. It's Maya Angelou. Yes. Yes. Angelou may have been known for her powerful words, but she was a true Renaissance woman. She had success as a singer, dancer, actress, composer, and Hollywood's first female black director. Yes. Additionally, Angelou also earned a Tony Award nomination, an Emmy Award nomination, and a Grammy for Best Spoken Word Album. Album. Maya Angelou made literary history with the first nonfiction bestseller by an African American woman. In 2000, Angelou was awarded the National Medal of Arts in 2010. She was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom. And in 2013, she was the recipient of the Literarian Award, an honorary National Book Award for her contributions to the literary canon. She also was, has been awarded over 50 honorary degrees during oh, her wow. lifetime. Wow. That's amazing. <laughs> Maya Angelou's work has been celebrated and taught throughout classrooms and homes around the world. She was indeed a phenomenal woman, and a phenomenal woman indeed. Yes. <laughs> we thank you for your contribution to the literary arts. Here, here for all these amazing women. And can I also say, yes. Here, here for how well we read that. I mean, we can read. We was reading, boy. We was we reading. Can read. Yes, yes, yes. That's all the women we have and that we are crushing on this one. Favorite Real Fam for this Black History Month. We want to hear what history-making sheroes you love. So let us know at therealdoc.com.